Hello, my name is Heather Cole Edwards and today I'm going to be walking you through how to use the Woodcock Johnson 4. The Woodcock Johnson 4 Tests of Achievement are a 20 section norm referenced achievement test which assesses both academic achievement, what children have learned in school, and cognitive development. The test is given to students who are being considered for special education services. The skills tested on the Woodcock Johnson Test of Cognitive Abilities are Comprehension knowledge, long-term retrieval, visual spatial thinking, auditory processing, fluid reasoning, processing speed, short-term memory, and quantitative knowledge. There are 20 subtests that may be administered in any order to determine a student's writing, reading, and mathematics skills. You can find subtests 1 through 11 in the standard test book, Form A or subtests 12 through 20 in the extended book. The test is designed for the administrator to read the script on their side while the student answers on their own. You will record student responses in the test booklet. There are certain things you can and cannot tell the student during the test. The booklets come with a set. One is a test record for the teacher, which at the top of the page you fill in the student information, followed by testing observation, and there is also a test response booklet for students to write their answers in. Scoring is to be completed during testing to determine the basal level. This is the first six answers the student answers correctly consecutively. At this point, you have established your starting point or your basal. The ceiling point, however, is when the student answers 10 incorrect questions in a row. At this point, you will stop, assuming the student will continue to give the incorrect response. At this point, you have also established your ceiling level. Incorrect responses are recorded verbatim. Raw scores are totaled and converted into age and grade equivalents. Percentile ranks and discrepancy scores with the use of the scoring tables. For example, the scorer can use the number of questions the student got correctly to determine the age and grade equivalency of the student. You'll record this in the teacher booklet. It is important to note that you may only use this booklet once per student. The Woodcock Johnson 4 is a comprehensive cognitive battery with strong technical qualities and two alternate forms for filling in answers. Scoring is quick, fairly quick and accurate. This assessment tool is widely used by special education teachers and school psychologists. By identifying the student's area of need, we can make better, more informed decisions when writing goals for the IEP.